well I messed up here and uh, didn't turn the mic on so what I'm saying here is we got this log right here behind us we're gonna pull it with the truck down the hill goes up there a little ways it's cut loose from the stump so it'll make a nice easy pull then got a I'm gonna throw an old choker and got this yellow strap here that I'll uh, use but choker has a you know it's a little beat up I want to put some gloves on her get the little cable splinters you know and I thought it might be bound up and I'd have to put a wrap on it but once I kind of give it a little pull there I see it wiggles pretty easy so shouldn't be any issue with just uh, pulling it straight on down I just threw that up uh, there's a couple small sections in the back of the truck just a couple but I uh, had already jerked them down with just the strap it was across the road on the way up here so I just threw that around the uh, back rack there you know since unhooking everything when you're just driving a little ways up so I'll show you the tree here It, uh, I never measured the total length but it goes up there a bit you can see it's a right up here right <laughs> almost in the clouds it's snow levels just up above me it's kind of a chilly day but I had already worked my way up it and limbed it just so I didn't have a bunch of those hanging it up but we'll get it get set up here and hopefully you get a pretty good view of it fire the truck up and pull it on down and you can see all the way up there where it kind of hooks around that tree it's was pretty rotten cut like three feet or so off uh, to get out of the rot left that up there with the small root ball you know didn't just go nice and smooth here won't have to give it a hard jerk or anything sometimes you hit it with just a little momentum and that helps to uh, get it moving and that's where a truck's better than a winch is speed but slow it digs in but it just stands up and that, that brush in there is gnarly it's a combination of vine maples and uh, blackberry vines there we go Got it all jerked down, a lot easier to deal with, and we'll go on from there. So I got it down here. Let me show you. This is a Husqvarna 435. Picked up used yesterday, as a matter of fact. Threw the chain up on the grinder, straightened it out. First Husqvarna. I'm kind of a steel fan, but price was right, and I was wanting a small little saw. Uh oh, 16, 18 inch bar. I'm not real sure which one. But I'll do a little, uh, little cutting with it here. Okay, and then just to kill these in the comment, safety glasses, earplugs, chaps that tuck inside the double leg. So, here we go.
Some cable here but I won't need it I'll just bury it with logs got the winch on the front if we ended up needing it but this stuff was definitely dead it's good and dry so but it's not rotten at all Oh, I'll straighten up.
we go. Now these last four are a little bigger. No sense carrying them. Loaded up, not much, but it's something. <laughs> 